It's really important. So you go downstairs and you get Johnny the butter. Go get the butter. Butter stick. You think he'll do it? Yeah. I, I think he's going to do it too. I, did, I really never, you know, it's something that you you kind of saw this growth as like yeah. an opportunity for you. Yeah. <laughs> Stop it, Rocky. Take it easy. Rocky, go ahead. Mommy's calling you. How's everybody doing in here? Great. Awesome. You know, I, I had to make two trips to the car. I really wanted to come in and make a big deal of saying hello to Sam because I, I didn't yesterday. yesterday. Made a big deal out of Stefan. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but I have so much stuff in the car. I was like, all right, let me come in and make my first trip. I'll get my second trip. So I'll, maybe I'll do that anyway. <laughs> Did I get the piece? Well, that's a conversation. Well, the short answer is no, but we're making progress. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, He's got the butter. Awesome. Oh, Thank you. Yeah. You're there he goes. I, I like it no problem. I like it no problem. I like how Sam is telling everybody how to uh, be polite to each other. What's Johnny supposed to say? He's your big cousin, John. I'm teaching matters in this house. That's right. <laughs> you know what? That's a normal brotherhood right there. How about that? Okay. That we haven't had in 15 years. Okay. Let Johnny have a moment. <laughs> That's true. I do send Johnny all over the house for me. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dude, every time we have people over, he's like, John, gotta go up and get me this. Go get the salt. Go get me the oregano. That's true. Go get the spatula. Go get the gloves. Yeah. Go get me a bowl. It's Nikki's turn. It's Nikki's turn. Sammy! Hey! What's up? Hey! <laughs> John John! I love it. Nikki, oh, you are a good boy. <laughs> so I have the fan. I went to the parts store. I don't have a new fan. I don't know how to fix it, but I have a number, which I'm going to give to you. This is Pat. Pat says he can fix anything. He's going to come here tomorrow. And he said, uh, Pat, I can fix everything. That's he said to me, um, Pat, who can fix everything? <laughs> that's what he said. I, I said it's a, Pat the repair. I, I said, well, you know, I thought it was this because I plug in the fan and it doesn't, you know, it doesn't spin. And he said to me, oh my God, everyone's going to laugh at this. He said to me, well, he's like, well, did you have the door open? I was like, well, yeah, I had the door open. How would I see? He's like, yeah, the fan goes off when the door's open. Oh, no! Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. So he says you didn't, he says you didn't Wait, take... I know, I know. Oh my! God. He did say, "No, we don't have an appointment." He said, "Call tomorrow." You just, you don't, you don't make appointments with Pat, the repair guy. You, you call. That's how that works. I'll call him right now. No, no, no. He said he was very specific. These guys, they don't play around. You do anything. They got a big sign. You give him an attitude. The price goes up. Oh. <laughs> At the parts store that Marianne recommended. So he said to me. You didn't take it apart any worse than this, did you? You didn't do anything else to the refrigerator, did you? So that's the story. I was like, no. I didn't say anything about what we did with the freezer. Why don't we just call Uncle Ernie? Uncle has got a full-time job, man. He ain't got no time to... So, so he was very nice. Um, not to be trifled with, clearly. He knows Oak Beach. He comes over here. He knew Jed. Um, so... I got a good feeling. So we're going to call Pat tomorrow. He said, call me tomorrow. He has our number. And he said, you know, I think I can get over there tomorrow. So he, he should be able to come tomorrow. Okay. He told me he can fix anything. So. Okay. He's our man then. I like the confidence. Yeah. I love him. I love him already. Yeah. Oh, no, you're going to like him. No, he's a good guy. He's in the tribe. Clearly. I had an idea, John, John, I want you to be part of this as well because uh, I'm glad you're reading. Um, to, to work out with Nicholas today. I mean, I don't know if you had other stuff. Oh, are you leaving to go work right now? Are you out of this conversation? <laughs> All right. So what I was thinking to try to okay. kind of make his workout a little bit more like a typical kid, mm -hmm. as opposed to all of us waiting on him or just assisting him to the degree that we do. Uh, right. I wanted to have it more like, you're working out with a partner 
where one person does a set, then the other person does a set. Right. So as opposed to him sitting down and saying, okay, hit the timer, mm -hmm. you know, he's going to be looking at, you know, what the other person's doing and is it my turn to go? Okay. You know, I just, I kind of, I thought that would serve a few purposes. Number one, I wanted to work out. Right. So I thought that would, right, I would get a workout in. And uh, number two, I just thought it would be a great way to make him feel more like part of what's going on as opposed to not only that, just feeling like he's somebody that needs so much assistance, you know? Right, a little bit more independent. Right, right, exactly. That's what I was thinking. So I thought it would be great if the three of us were working out, and Sammy too if he wants. But you're going to work. But you're going to eat bagels and eggs. Okay, that's okay. No, I just thought of this idea before, so. So that's what I was thinking. I love it. I think it's a good idea. Yeah. Hey, you. You snuck away from everybody? You getting tired? Oh. Did you have a good day? I heard you had a good day. I saw Mrs. Harrison. She said you were awesome. Did you have a great day with Mrs. Harrison? Yes. Good. Well, I can feel that heater. Oh, sorry. Looking good, Nick James. He's just making it for Lego? Yeah. yeah, he's in the yeah. zone. He's just mixing. Yeah. It's a tough transition to the... Yeah. But you know what? It's going to keep him regulated through the night, yeah. you know? I miss me. We'll do the laundry, okay? Bye, right, so. Yeah? Good cooperation. So here's what we're going to do. You go on the bike, and we're only going to go for 30 seconds. Whoa, is there enough room there? What happened? Oh, ow. No, ow. No, ow. No, ow. Mask guy. No, that's, no, that's going to hurt. No. You okay? Yeah. And then we're going to go over here, okay? We're going to switch. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Turn that on here, Sammy. That's all right. Now. 30 seconds. Gotta go hard, Nikki, okay? Alright. And then we're gonna do what daddy's doing. Okay, go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
His favorite songs is Let It Snow. Yes. And I just thought it would be fun to sing with him, so I just opened up the notes and it's a really easy song to play. But I gotta look at the notes because I've never played it. And Nikki's gonna sing with me. You ready? You ready? Oh, the Alright, come over here. Come over here so I can come look at the notes though. Here he comes. Come on. Come on, Nikki. That's great. Oh, he's singing from the couch. Kira, come here, pretty girl. Five old life Says there's no place to go Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow Doesn't show signs of stopping Brought to call for fire Lights are turned down low Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow That was awesome, man. That's Give awesome. me a high five. Oh, you know, he's trying. He's he's vibing on the couch, like he's he's like he's a boss. <laughs> <laughs> and Kira's getting in the way. Get off of here! Get off of here! That's good talking, Nick. I'm scared. I'm okay. Oh. I'm okay. I'm scared. I'm scared. She's like, make some room for me. She got him to adjust. Goodness, she's so needy. Oh my God, you gotta get off there. Are you nuts? Get down. Get down right now. You're not allowed up there. I don't know what's wrong with her, Rocky. She can't, she's not a rule follower like you. Oof, hey. Whoa, goodness gracious. I have some tuna steaks. Okay, beautiful. And um, I made you. Rocky, get out of here. You can't have no cauliflower tuna steaks. rice risotto. Damn. 
And is that what tomato sauce? Yeah. Oh my god, that's gonna be unbelievable. I made peppers and mushrooms and uh, spinach and salad. And we're gonna so have that on the tuna. Want? I want a yes. You want it? All. <laughs> no, no. Which no. one do you want? And you're putting the. Uh, no, no, by half in one. This stuff we just came across, which is just a blessing. Oh God, I mean, I wonder, does everybody that. around the country know about yes. everything bagel seeds? Yes, everybody does. Because you We're should. We're late to the party. Are we late to the party? 100%. Here, get out of it. Get away from the food, girl. She's and we're going to put on that on the edges of the tuna or all over the yeah, whole thing? Yeah, on the edge. It's going to be very exciting. Yeah. I would, can I have the tuna on a bed of risotto and with a little spinach on top? That's what sure. I was thinking. That's that's what I, I was. I do that for you. That's what my question was. Fantastic. What would you like, sir? I would like that. That sounds great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Healthy. All right. So this looks fantastic. Shani, put yours on salad. That looks great. And we are gonna try to see if we get Nick to taste a little tuna, cauliflower risotto, and spinach. Let's give it a shot. This is very much like, I was going to say like a hamburger. This is kind of like a hamburger. Try that right there. It's a fish burger. Mm -hmm. Fish. Fish burger. Lives in the city fish. with SpongeBob. SpongeBob. Pineapples. Mm. Why are you doing it here? You're happy. Give it a try. You, I bet you're going to like it. Mm. it. It has everything bagel seeds on it. See? <laughs> Can you try that piece? Peas. I'm going to have mine. That's not trying it. Try it. Do you want to try the spinach? The spinach? How about the spinach? Spinach gives you big oh, muscles. Oh, 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 oh. oh, take that off. Okay, that's okay. The doggy will eat it. That's okay. That fell on the floor. Kira. Kira loves it. You want to try the spinach? Yes. Oh, thank you. He's such a good boy. Oh, thank you. You can do it, Nick. And if you do it, I'm going to make you a hamburger right away, and we'll have some Starburst afterwards if you eat that spinach. Want some strawberry pink? It's delicious. Eat that. Mm. It's good. Mm. <laughs> it's a good it's try, good. buddy. It's so good. It's just, I get a paper towel. I get a paper towel. It's the right around. No, the dog sense what's going on here. They're like, this is an opportunity. Yeah. yeah. This is going to go on the ground? Yeah. And we got a good one here. Okay, why don't we try the tuna again? Can you try that tuna again? I'm going to make you a hamburger. It's going to be delicious. You're going to raise it. No, that's for you, Nick. Mommy has her, see? That, it's very much like a hamburger. It's just a fish burger. It's a fish burger. It's a fish burger. It's, a fish burger. it's in the sea. It was in a pineapple under the sea. Perfect. There's resistance to the sea. You can do it, Nick. I'm nervous. <laughs> look, Daddy's eating it. Look, look, Daddy's eating it. Mmm. Nick, it 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 is it has a very similar consistency to a cheeseburger. Taste that, Nick. It's it's like a hamburger. Come on, you can do it. You got good job. Okay, it's a good start. Mm. Oh, that's good. You like it. Go ahead and eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. You like it. You just you just tasted it. Mm. Mm. Put it in. Chew it like a cheeseburger. Chew, chew. You want to put some ketchup on it? Okay, let's try it. I'll try, try it. I bet you if we put a little ketchup on it, he'll like it. I'll go get it. Oh, All right, Nikki Bear. You have your your hamburger now. Is it delicious? Okay, juice. <laughs> okay, juice. There's juice right there. You can do the juice. When you're, he's like, okay, juice. Excuse you. Slow down. Good job. Way to go.